Are you ready to stop smoking? Well, I'm going to show you a very easy way to just kill those cravings. Not that the cigarettes kill you or shorten your life. Imagine this, that when you buy these, you actually pay to shorten your life. So now I'm going to show you an easy technique that would help to relieve or eliminate the craving. I've used this many times and that's all is necessary. Remove the craving. No need for these anymore. You can just chuck them away. Okay, so for this you will need some cigarettes. And if you're going to do this exercise with me, I want you not to have had a cigarette for at least one hour. Okay, because we're working on cravings. You will not have much of a craving if you just had a cigarette. Okay, so I want you to have at least a bit of a craving going. Okay, so assuming that you have not had a cigarette for one hour, here we go. Your packet of cigarettes, and for a start, just holding those packet of cigarettes in your hand, right? How much of a craving have you got for the cigarette that's inside? Zero to ten. What number pops to mind? Now, whatever number pops to mind, just go with it. I don't want you to start thinking, well, what number should it be? You'll know. There'll be kind of this little, this little voice in your mind going, mm, it's this number. That's the number I want. And I want you to follow along. If you don't understand how EFT works, what I'm going to teach you, this tapping technique, that's okay. Just follow along with me. You don't need to know how it works. You don't need to know how the engine works in your car for you to drive the car. You just let the mechanic fix it. So I'm just going to show you something to follow along with me for a few minutes and change your life forever and save you a fortune and lengthen your life in a few minutes. So here we go. So cigarette box, cigarette inside, zero to ten. What number pops to mind when you think about having that cigarette? Okay, with that number in mind, I want you to tap here on the side of your hand and say out loud after me, this is the only way it's going to work for you, say out loud after me and if you're in company, watch this video when you're not because people may think you're crazy. But when crazy works, it's worth doing because it's not really crazy. It's just you becoming in tune, mind and body working together to stop that habit. So again, 0 to 10, what number pops to mind of wanting a cigarette? Even though I really want that cigarette, I'm okay now. Say those words. Even though I really want that cigarette, I'm okay now. Even though I really want that cigarette, I'm okay now. Now you just need to say that three times. Now, two fingers, side of the eyebrow, near the bridge of your nose. That cigarette. Side of the eye, on the bone, that cigarette. Under the eye, on the bone, that cigarette. Under the nose, that cigarette. Chin point, which is between the chin and the bottom lip, that cigarette. Collarbone, that cigarette. Just tap on the edge of the collarbone, near your throat. Under the arm, that cigarette near level with your nipple and top of the head near where a hairband to be worn by a young girl that cigarette take a deep breath in as best you can and release that now now hold those cigarettes in your hand now if the same number comes up that's okay zero to ten what number of craving do you have for the cigarette in that box okay now we're going to move inside and just look at the cigarettes and sniff the box. I know, I used to be a smoker, so there's a certain smell from an actual cigarette box, not just a cigarette and so on. Zero to ten, what number pops to mind of craving for that cigarette? Okay, with that number, here we go again. Even though I have that craving remaining for that cigarette, I'm okay. Even though I have that craving for that cigarette, I'm okay. Now if you don't, don't want to say these words, 
that's okay. Just follow along, you will still benefit just by doing this. Even though I have that remaining craving for that cigarette, I'm okay. That remaining craving. 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 Now we're aiming for tapping on all these points around seven times. You don't have to count them, just roughly around seven times. So I'll take a deep breath in. Release that now. Cigarette box. Close the box. Zero to ten, what number pops to mind? Just notice what changes. That little voice inside your head going, it's a little less, it's a little less. I have no idea. But I do know that this works. Now the next thing I want you to do is I want you to take the cigarette out and just hold it in your hand. Because that brings craving up for some people. Okay? Zero to ten, what number pops to mind? Okay. Cigarette away. Even though I still have that craving, I'm okay now. Even though I still have that craving, I'm okay now. Even though I still have that craving, I'm okay now. That craving. 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 Take a deep breath in. And release all that now. Take your cigarette up. Zero to ten. What number pops to mind? Very good. So, perhaps hold the cigarette the way you normally hold it. And notice what number pops to mind. Okay. So we'll just move on to the next section where we're going to get even more craving removed from wanting that cigarette. Welcome back. And the last round of tapping with EFT we did, you're holding the cigarette whatever way you like to hold it. Okay? Now this time I want you, to, I want you to smell it. Whatever way I smell. The tobacco, smell along it. Zero to ten, what number pops to mind of craving when you do that? Okay, so with that number of craving, tap along with me. Even though I have that number of craving because of the smell of that cigarette, I'm okay. Even though I have that number of craving because of the smell of that cigarette, I'm okay. Even though I have that number of craving because of the smell of that cigarette, I'm okay. That number of craving. 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 Take a deep breath in. And release all that now. Okay. So here we go. Get your cigarette, smell it again. And notice. Zero to ten, what number pops to mind? Of remaining craving about that smell. That aroma. Okay. Even though I still have a little bit of craving remaining, I'm okay. Even though I still have a little bit of craving remaining, I'm okay. Even though I still have a little bit of craving remaining, I'm okay. Still have a little bit of craving remaining. 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 Take a deep breath in. And release that now. So this time, what I want you to do is I want you to hold your cigarette the way you normally do. Begin to bring it up towards your mouth, the way you normally would, before you light it, whatever way that is. Just think of the lighter. 
if you're left handed, from your left hand, right hand, whichever. So bring it up to your mouth, okay, as if you're bringing it up. And notice 0 to 10 what number pops to mind of craving as you bring that closer to your mouth. Now you might at this stage feel like, I don't really want that. However, if that's it, if that's where you're at, perfect. If not, we just want to give you the best from this experience. So just bringing it up to your mouth, okay, 0 to 10, what number of craving of taking that cigarette in your mouth and lighting it. Okay. Even though I have that craving for lighting that cigarette, I'm okay now. Even though I have that craving for lighting that cigarette, I'm okay now. Even though I have that craving for lighting that cigarette, I'm okay now. Now what I should have said was, when you bring that up, okay, what I want you to notice is, one I want you to notice, what number pops to mind of craving as you bring that cigarette up. The other thing is I want you to notice where that craving may be in your body. Okay? So if you have a number pops to mind, that's okay. But if you have a craving, it could be taste, anywhere, wherever that is, I want you to focus on that sense, that sensation of craving. Excellent. So even though I have that sensation of craving, some people may say it's just in my head. Whatever it is, either the number, sensation in your head, thought in your mind, feeling, whatever it is, just focus in that, on that. We're going to call it a sensation. Even the number is a number of a sensation. Even though I have that sensation of craving for that cigarette, I'm okay now. Even though I have that number of sensation for that craving, I'm okay now. Even though I have that number of sensation for that craving, I'm okay now. That sensation, that craving 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 sensation. Take a deep breath in. And release that now. Now as you take that cigarette up, smell it, look at it, hold it in your hand. If there's any remaining craving, I'm going to bring you through one more exercise. It may seem a little silly, but just follow along with me. Do the best you can. You can go back through this whole video and do it as many times as you wish, if you need to. But hopefully, by the end of this video, you'll go, I'm not interested in that cigarette. So what I want you to do is, you see your little finger and your ring finger, there's a groove in there, I want you to tap there. And at the same time, as you tap there, you're working on this remaining craving, I want you to close your eyes, and then open your eyes. And then without moving your head, move your eyes down to the left, looking at the floor. And then without moving your head, move your eyes down to the right, looking at the floor, to the corner of your eyes. And then, Roll your eyes clockwise round in a circle and then anti-clockwise round a circle again without moving your head. And then here's an even sillier part. I want you to hum a few bars of Happy Bertie. I'm going to do it too. And I'm doing it live on camera so lots of people can see it. You're doing it on your own so it shouldn't be a problem. So go mm -hmm, mm -hmm, and then count up to five. One, two, three, four, five, and then hum happy bird again. Okay, you can stop tapping, take a deep breath in, and release that now. And all you're doing when you hum happy bird and count numbers is you're connecting both sides of your brain. One part of your brain deals with numbers and language and things like that, and the other part is the creative part. The right hand side is the creative part, subconscious mind and the left hand side is where you do all your calculating of numbers and things like that so it's just connecting the two together so we've mind both sides of the mind and the body connected the one goal in mind of no more craving for that cigarette so smell it 
hold it, bring it up to your mouth, and hopefully what you'll be doing is gone. They're not for me. Thank you.